Welcome to the show. I'm Corinne. And I'm LaShondra, and together we're Everyday CNAs. Let's talk about magic for a minute. Behind the camera, every show has that go-to person. Yes. Ours is Gary Omar. Gary O for short. He's quick on the draw with smile, set still now, <laughs> set still, and don't look at me, look at that camera. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, meet Gary O. Hey there, ladies. Um, by that introduction, I, I seem to be, it seems to come across as maybe a rude person, <laughs> and I apologize if it seems yeah. that way, but, but I, don't, I don't intend to be. I'm just trying to help you out, and um, there you well, go. Well, we have a few questions uh, for you, so we're going to play Get to Know Gary. Oh, <laughs> that sounds very painful yeah. <laughs> and uh, not too exciting, but go ahead. All right, Gary, how did you become interested in producing and directing? Well, when I was seven years old, I received a camera and a box of fiddle faddle. I don't know if you can remember that, what that is, but it's an old <laughs> yes, Cracker I Jacks do. Um, clone, maybe, or, or something. But I enjoyed uh, the, the camera. It, it turned into, and it was the old camera where it was just a one snap camera, 126 millimeter film. And I took a lot of pictures and turned into a hobby. And from that, um, uh, KSN, uh, and when I was 23, KSN News, the NBC affiliate locally, I, I went and applied and got a job, worked there for 10 years, and um, doing a lot of things for them. Um, I shot five presidents, <laughs> and I walked away, and everything's fine, <laughs> but uh, it, I had a lot of experience over the years, and... Um, and then it seems like I ha always had a, sh uh, a shoulder with a camera. The shoulder, maybe, it's, maybe you can tell, there's always a, an indention there because I had a camera there so much when I was taking pictures of my children. My wife and I had, had three, have three daughters and all the sporting events, the music events, uh, we have uh, a majority of those on camera because I kept it right there on the shoulder and, and captured all those and we look back and enjoy those. And from there, I uh, worked at an advertising agency for, for 10, 12 years. And then 2011 is when I began with the National Association of Healthcare Assistants. And um, there we go. So wow. what are um, some of your hobbies that you like to do? Well, along with photography being a hobby, I, I do, I enjoy music a lot. Um, I enjoy piano. I really enjoy playing guitar, bass guitar, and I play on stage at our church, uh, just you know, on some worship teams. And I really do enjoy that. That that's very, um, very uplifting uh, to me. And I, it's, it's a calm in my life that um, that I need. And speaking of music, though, we have a few videos of you on Facebook singing and playing the keyboard. Uh, you are very talented, so when did you start singing? Well, I have two brothers, and from as early as I can remember, we would we sang together. Uh, my dad was a preacher, and we'd, we'd be with uh, mom and dad at places, and they'd ask us to sing and uh, twist our arm at times. <laughs> but, and I, I don't think we minded, but... But at an early age, we, we started singing, and those were good times. Um, right. Yeah. LaShonda and I was um, talking about it, um, actually on the way drive here this morning, and they're very um, inspirational. And I like yeah. how you, I'm listening to the music, but I can also hear your voice and at the same time, like scroll down and actually read all the words that you're singing. So mm. they're very inspirational. You know, I, I just, I sensed, and as a lot of people did through the early times that we were in lockdown with the, the virus, um, I sensed that people needed hope. People needed uh, just inspiration in their lives. And yeah. I mean, God, God has provided that to me 
through music, um, just uh, an assurance that he's there with me. And I wanted to share that with people. I, I wanted that to be something that maybe people could um, could receive positively and uh, give them some some hope. Yeah. Well, I have to I have to be honest with you, Gary. Sometime on my way to work, I do scroll back to your Facebook because I have Bluetooth in the car, and I do listen to some of your music <laughs> on my way to work. Because I'm telling you, at this time, like he said, yeah. during this pandemic, we need very inspirational. Yeah. Going to work every day, don't know what's going to happen if they're going to tell you, you got, you got to go home, you know. So exactly. Right. Yeah, we. You, I really we, we enjoy may have that. have to have a new. TV show on CNA TV with you, you know, doing yeah, some that would of your be great because it's well, really yeah. yeah. I think a lot of our residents would like it because it's very smoothing. It's oh, that's very a good calming. idea because the resident I have that watches mm -hmm. our show, he would yeah. love to look at that. Yeah, have to do that out yeah. there. Yeah, and then the last question, I'm going to kind of put you on the spot. How has it been working with NACA and all of these CNAs over the years? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> We're putting you on the spot. <laughs> I've enjoyed working um, working with NACA and, and it turning into CNA TV. Um, we started that and then in the last two years, but yet early on, it's the passion that NACA has in helping CNAs across the country, giving them resources, um, online resources, coaching, and the different things that they do, I'm inspired by. And I really, I, I really love the mission of NACA and their, their vision for the future. We do awesome every year on our um, videos and everything. And well, thank um, you. we just wanna um, thank you for everything that you do here um, at at NACA, yes. we uh, we appreciate everything you do um, as well for Lashonda and I on our show. I sure. know both of us look up to you yes. and, and appreciate your um, guidance and everything, especially getting onto Lashonda about looking at the camera <laughs> well, and setting still. I hope it's a gentle but, um, way. You know, we just want to really um, let you know that we do uh, appreciate everything that uh, you do for us here at, at NACA. Absolutely. Yes, thank you, Gary. Thanks for letting me be on. And uh, don't forget all the other great shows that um, he's yes. responsible for and helped create. And that was CNA Heroes with Lisa Sweet, mm -hmm. um, LTC News with Dane Henning. And uh, make sure you hit and... Um, Hit that subscribe button, um, make that comment, and leave us a message. And uh, if you have any questions for Gary O, the man behind the camera, um, let's hear from you.